All this mail! <laughs> hey guys, this is Vess and welcome back to another unboxing. So in this unboxing, I'm going to be unboxing something from Kickstarter. Um, Justin was basically watching this and he saw it he thought it was cool and he funded it it's a another indie comic artist and what we like to do here is do the indie comic stuff because nobody else does indie comics like i don't know why so um if you guys want like a different like a set of like an unboxing it could be like a something with artists maybe we can think of a title for it because Honestly speaking, nobody does indie comics or web comics, so I think I should be the one to do it. What you think about that? Um, put your comments down below, see how you guys feel about it. But as of right now, I am unboxing um, a manga, not a manga, a comic, because this is a comic book style. So the comic. I think it's XOB, that's what it says, or is spelt different. But let's go at it. Um, they gave us this white sleeved, uh, you know, thing. It has my address and stuff, and their address, so yas. <laughs> and uh, it's just plain old white. I think it's kind of cool that it's white. And I'm opening it up. And what do we have in y'all? Let's see, guys. Let's see. So, seems like we got a lot of goodies. Ooh, hold on, hold on, ah, uh, we got everything out, okay, so yes guys, uh, this is the XOB comic, it comes with little stickers and the, this brochure, this, well not brochure, but a flyer, and it comes with the book, I think this is issue one, yeah, this is issue one, and it also came with pictures of a cosplayer that's cosplaying in the girl's outfit. So it says XOB modeled by Chrissy Cha. Um, photography by... I can't read script so I'm not even going to try. And uh, this is by Tourist Comics. Um, she is gorgeous. Like honestly speaking, ain't she? She hot! Oh my god! Um, yeah. So I guess I'll show you these first because I think she's gorgeous. So this is the first one, and that's how it looks. Doesn't she look gorgeous, guys? And then this is the second one. Well, it's not a picture of her, but it's a resemblance, I will say, because she kind of looks like the girl. If, can you see it? <laughs> she kind of looks like her. I wish that they made her hair glow, like for a photo tip. Um, I would make her hair glow so that she can match with the character, but honestly speaking, she looks like the character, so I'm kind of cool with that. Um, but yeah, these are like almost, you know, mini posters and I like the way they are. The paper feels really good. It's like photo paper, but light. Um, and I think the character is gorgeous. Like this is a very gorgeous character and so is the cosplayer. So they did a good job on, you know, having somebody cosplay. Um, we went with the $30 bundle, so we basically get extra stuff. Um, so yeah, that was that. Let me go ahead and put it back in the sleeve because, you know, I don't want to mess it up. And, uh, you know, Justin hasn't seen it yet. So, you know, trying to do be the good wife. <laughs> uh, give me one minute. So, yeah, we're back with this. And um, this is the comic, the flyer, and the little stickers below. Um, again, they use that same character. Like, if you see the stickers here, uh, they use that same character that they used for the image. And she's a gorgeous looking character. I like how diverse she looks. I guess that's just me and how I feel about it. But I, I feel that she looks very diverse and she's nice. Um, I got three little stickers of it. So see these little three stickers. Stop. They're really cute. Like I like it. I don't know where I will put it. But I find a place. I find a place. <laughs> I will find a place for it. Um, and then this is another sticker. I thought it was a flyer. But it's a sticker and it says big treecomics.com so I think this is a place where they went ahead and they printed out their books which is kind of cool because I have a printer also and every indie comic has to print out their own books and this is the book full in its flesh with the signature of the person who wrote the book now uh, when it comes down to the person that wrote the book he went through two artists throughout this campaign he had one do one half and I guess within that half 
that one fell through so he had to get another one um and this is the produce of it i think it's gonna look the same regardless but we don't know um we don't know till we read it right um so yeah as you can see it's all in color and i feel like it's really gorgeous the way it looks um i guess this is the main character this woman here with the fiery looking hair uh, i didn't get into the context of who's who because Justin, he was the one that went ahead and he was like, another indie comic, why not try it out? So boom, uh, <laughs> there we go. So yeah, guys, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna read some of it and I'm gonna come back to you and give you a small little review on it because along with the unboxings of an indie comic artist, I would love to go ahead and just do a review on it and how I feel and all that good stuff and especially the art and stuff. Um, again, this is all my opinion, so you know if you feel a certain type of way about it i'm sorry but this is my opinion um i'm not always right so i'm just gonna say that for sure i say it in every single video when i do reviews or i talk about things because i guess people don't get that everybody has an opinion <laughs> so yeah definitely so yeah guys i'm gonna go ahead take a quick read and i'll be back yeah guys so i'm back and i read it and honestly speaking is really good um as for the storyline, it's about this girl, she is XOB, but it turns out XOB is some type of like powers that they have because um, there's different ones within the galaxy, I think, or just realms in general. Um, this guy, he's the evil lord, I don't know how to pronounce his name, so I'm not going to pronounce his name at all, but he's the one that's like trying to gather her powers so that he can open up, um, so he can un unlock himself from the realm that he's locked in um i'm not gonna ruin it all because there's some stuff that happens in here it's pretty good um in the back the creator says that they're working on issue two and they're thanking everybody who helped them with issue one and um they just have one little misspell right here and i wish that wasn't there but it instead of hope instead of saying hope it says ope so i hope that um they see this so that they can just edit that one piece um but all in all everything looked good the writing and spelling everything was good inside here so there was really no problems with that um it was cool to see her friend her friends um they also have some type of power because stuff happens and you see it so it's kind of cool to see that and she's like a superhero within her town so she's in i think she's in washington and it's called green hill so she's a student she goes to green hill university and uh, I think her name is Laura. Let me be clear before I even like give you guys some shenanigans, you know what I'm saying? Cause your girl could give you shenanigans. No, her name is Tracy Laura. So that's why I thought Lori. Um, so her name is Tracy Laura and she's XOB, the lightning wielder. Um, it's kind of cool with her powers because her, her powers, even though they're lightning, they look like fire. And um, another good part about it, even though he changed artists or, yeah, even though he changed artists, you did not really, it didn't feel like it. You know what I'm saying? Everything was consistent. Everything looked the same. So I was very pleased to see that. Um, and I was very pleased to see just how the stories developed. Um, she talks a lot, I will say like, as she fights she's talking about insurance and stuff and like oh you know i don't got you know i don't have enough money to you know be paying for the villains insurance and all that stuff and the villains is talking back to her so it's kind of like it's different to well it's not different but it's you know i see it a lot in a lot of um comics and stuff where the they're fighting and talking at the same time like how do you even have the breath to do so i guess my stamina is not there but yeah that's how they do it um she's very like she just talks and it's it's kind of funny because it's also as if she's like trying to tell a joke within her talking and fighting at the same time like when the one of the villains come and they hit her and she's like he's like you know by the time um you don't have to worry about deductibles because by the time i'm done with you you know you'll be dead so she's like well you know he hits her whatever she flies back and she's like well i'm happy with my insurance now so you know it's kind of um it's kind of like 
a little humor in there so that was kind of cool about this again um tourist comics made this uh down here is the people who have created it and uh put their you know put their talents together there's there's a writer there's a background artist and there's an artist for um the people i think is line work and the other one is color i'm not too sure because there are four people um but that's how the, that this is set up so th they could crank it out you know what i'm saying they have a nice team um can't wait to see what what else comes through um and can't wait to see what justin thinks about it honestly um not too sure when he's going to be able to read it but uh, i'm going to give him some time to read it and see what he thinks but so far in my opinion i think it's it's really good and um i recommend it so definitely come take a look at this and uh definitely give them a shout out i'll be putting their facebook down below um if i can find it because i found this on because i was part of a facebook club thing where they you know distribute art and they talk about their their kickstarter and stuff like that so i just wanted to be helpful you know and i wanted to see what other people have because you know i just click 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 and if i see something i like it i click it and justin this is the first time he ever did something so this is kind of awesome to be reviewing something that he was into so yeah <laughs> definitely that was a mouthful um again guys check these check these guys out tourist comics very beautiful art um lovely good story good um way to start it off um you know bring the characters together it needs a little bit more character development but it's the first book so i'm not going to really complain about that um but all in all really good as a starter and i can't wait to see what they come up next so if you guys like this video <laughs> go ahead and hit that like and um tell me if if you get it or if you did get it Tell me in the comments below, like, what was your thoughts about it and how are you ready for the next issue and all that good stuff. Um, definitely show some love to the, uh, to these guys and tell them that this pulses send they love. Um, and also that the senior sent you. <laughs> um, again, guys, um, if you're new here and you're like, Beth, I like the way you do things. Um, thank you for, you know, showing another artist to me that that's really cool, you know, to represent and rep represent the indie comic society. <laughs> Go ahead and hit that subscribe and become a pulse. Become one of our family members. I continuously do things like this and more. And I want to do more because um, honestly speaking, there's a lot of stuff that hasn't been covered on YouTube and I feel like I need to cover it. That's how I feel. So if you want to be part of that ride, join our family. Um, again, guys, I stream every Friday, 7 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. And I'm thinking about Sunday, too, because I, you know, I stream every Sundays at noon Eastern Standard Time. That's what, 12 p.m.? Yeah. <laughs> um, come down, have fun with us, jokes and everything. You always see another side of me. Um, most of the time, I'm okay. Sometimes I'm just in pain or something happens where i'm like all crazy but we all love each other and we enjoy each other so definitely come down um again guys um thank you so much if you want me to ever review your comic or anything like that post it down below i'll review your comic on here i want to um extend myself to web comics also so definitely shut down the link down there and um yeah guys again thank you for watching sharing telling a friend and helping a friend have an amazing rest of the day bye bye